something beautiful? I made breakfast. I'm not hungry. Oh, come on, Star. You gotta eat something. I can't, okay? Look, I know that you're upset about breaking up with Cole. Hmm, you think? I'm sorry that I wasn't there for you. But you would have done anything anyway. Well, I would have tried to help. You would have helped me get back together with Cole? No, because I think you did the right thing. All right, well, it doesn't matter what you think because I'm not going to be with him anymore. Star, listen to me. I know that it hurts to let him go. I did it so that Dad wouldn't kill Cole. And that Dad's new girlfriend, the DA, wouldn't throw him in jail. It kills me to see you hurt like this, Star. I'm sorry. But what you did, it was right, and I'm proud of you. I'm glad for you because I feel like crap. Oh, baby. I mean, it's hard to put other people, you know, ahead of you, especially when you really, really want to be with a boy you like. Mom, I don't like him. I love him. Is that so hard to Star. understand? I love him. And I know that it hurts. Someday it won't hurt as much, really. Like it doesn't hurt with you and Dad anymore? What's well, different? Uh, it's not different. I love Cole, and right now I... I hate you Dad. You do not hate your father. You know that. I know, but... I don't think I'll ever feel the same way about him again. I understand. I understand that. You know, maybe we should just go easy on your dad right now. He's going through a hard time. He needs our support. Why? What happened? You know, the son that he had with Margaret Cochran? Well, he got a tip that um, maybe that baby is still alive after all. So he's going to go to Chicago and see what he can find out. He really thinks that the baby's alive. So he's going to go check it out. Well, I mean, how is he dealing with it? Is he okay? Well, I think he's got his hopes up, but... Well, we both know that he'll be completely devastated if he finds out that baby's dead again. But you know your dad. He's determined, and he's going to do what he's got to do. I don't think he should do it alone. What? Come you're on. Gonna, you're going to find out about it anyway. Your dad's not going alone. He's taking Evangeline Williamson with him. Why is Dad taking Evangeline? <sighs> You really have to ask? Well, I would hope that that whole thing would have been over by now. Uh, maybe. Maybe not, but he is going to take Evangeline with him because she pushed for it. And she kind of hinted that she would go to the police if he didn't. Are you kidding me? God, what a... Uh -huh. Don't say I'm it. not. We can think it. We just don't say it. I used to like her. Well, she's not my favorite person anymore, but we should just forget about it, okay? The most important thing here is you may have a little brother out there that's alive, and that's great. Is that going to be okay? What if Dr. Truman is just messing around with him or something? No, I hope not. You know that it would kill him. You need to help him, Mom. You he not doesn't want my help, sweetie. I doesn't. He says that, Mom, but you know that he needs you. What I need you to do is head out the door to school, okay? There you go. And star. You did the right thing with Cole. And I know that it's hard. But it'll get better, all right? Go help, Dad. For the baby with Miss Williamson. Were you eavesdropping? 
Just listening. It's not nice to listen in on other people's conversations. But if Dad's baby's alive, is he going to marry Miss Williamson and start a family without us? 